Hey guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel, Sarita's Intuitive Love Guidance. My name is Sarah. I'm going to be doing the daily divine masculine and feminine check. See what is currently going on with the masculine or how he is feeling towards the divine femme. So what is the major energies of how the masculine is feeling towards divine femme spirit? Turtle. He's in an energy of retreat still. I feel like he's trying to figure things out. Um, turtles are very slow energy, and I'm sure the Divine Femmes is like, how slow is he going to go? But I do feel like he's in an energy of trying to force something. I feel like this is an energy of him needing to be more in control, not feeling like he's backed into a corner. This needs to be his decision, his or her decision, in order to come forward. What else is going on with the Divine Masculine Spirit and how they're feeling towards the Divine Femme? Courage. I do feel like he could be a Leo due to I just seeing a lion. But he's trying to find some kind of courage to ask for what he wants from the Divine Femmes. He could be trying to tame the beast within, he or she. Um, but there is an energy of, you know, maybe he's feeling still a lack of self-worth not feeling valuable still, and so he's trying to find the courage due to X, Y, Z. Maybe he's kind of going through some things and his past issue, and he doesn't feel worthy of you, Divine Femmes. One more card, Spirit. How is Divine Masculine feeling towards Divine Femmes? Perseverance. Dig in and see it through completion. So he's in an energy of trying to persevere, trying to find self, wanting to dig himself out of a dirt or a situation that he could be currently in. So do know that that's why he's in retreat mode, trying to find his confidence and persevere through a situation that maybe he's currently going through at the moment. So angel spirits and guys, let's actually dig deeper into these. What is this retreat card about, Spirit? What is he going in retreat about when it comes to the divine films? Wow. He's definitely in an energy of at a crossroads, possibly trying to figure things out, trying to plan, because there's an energy of him wanting to put in what work, still have devotion, because he's wanting a fresh new start with the divine films. Wanting to be a little foolish and have a fresh new start and take a leap of faith. Um, but that requires him to loosen up his baggage. Let things that no longer serves him in his life. And so this masculine could be really in an energy of really retreating, figuring things out, planning of how to go about doing that. Um, going through some other resources, could be working on his finances. Do know we are in quarantine, so maybe he's a little worried about being able financially stable to provide for you, Divine Femmes, because he's in a planning energy. So he is definitely retreating and planning and figuring things out. Tell me more about retreat, Spirit. Tell me more about retreat. He's definitely contemplating of wanting to meet up with you, Divine Femmes. He's retreating, thinking about y'all's friendship. He's feeling a little uplifted, trying to savor the moment, contemplating about putting in work again with this relationship. Maybe kind of in an energy of going within, figuring out how to be creative, to be in an energy of taking a leap of faith to reach out to you. And so he's in an energy of a crossroads of how to do that. Let's see what this courage energy is about. What is this lion courage energy about, spirit? Let's push this over. What is this lion courage energy about? Because it says, ask for what you want. And this masculine is in an energy of wanting to come into communication with you. Rushing back in. I feel like he could be spying on you with your social media. And so look, it says, ask for what you want. But look at that. Five of Swords, mental anguish, mental battle, going back and forth with ego. Should I reach out? Should I not? Should I reach out? Should I not? And so he could be spying on you due to the retreat energy of kind of seeing where you're at. Maybe he's wondering if you're talking to somebody. 
Um, maybe you had cut communication off and now he's trying to find courage to reach out to be creative in, in that. Because maybe y'all had some words exchanged. Maybe there was some um, frustration, um, arguments that has happened. What does he want encouraged for when it comes to Divine Femmes? Yeah, I definitely feel like there was some kind of deception here. I feel like someone was being sneaky. And I feel like this could just be him being sneaky in the sense of <laughs> spying on you. Could be asking about family members or family friends about you. Because I feel like there's an energy of him feeling like a missed opportunity. Feeling rejected. I feel like some of these divine fans were not being receptive to being open to the masculine's love due to maybe you were triggered by something. Maybe you saw something. Maybe you were just wanting to know if he's done with the karmic third party situation. And if he's not, then you're not going to be open and receptive to um, be in communication with him. To accept his cup of love. To accept his new beginning. What is this courage energy about? Because if you look at this, like I said, the five of swords, he's holding five swords. That's that mental battle, should I? And he's looking at the two of swords. Um, a stalemate, unable to make a decision. He's like, I want to reach out to her, but I don't know. Um, he's in a mental battle, unable to make a decision when it comes to reaching out to you. Why? Because this is like the ace of swords to me. Wanting clarity, wanting to speak some kind of truth. And so there's a lot of swords here. There's a lot of communication that he's wanting to come in and do because there's an energy of transformation. Wanting to transform y'all's relationship, wanting to evolve. What is he wanting to persevere? Because it says dig in and see it through completion. He's wanting completion with you, Divine Femmes. Wow. He is wanting a spiritual union with you. Something, a very deep, connected energy. For some, it could be marriage. He is wanting to dig in and see through a completion of maybe he is married and wanting to be separated and wanting to be done and he's trying to persevere. And maybe that is why there's retreat because he's in a situation. For some, it could just be he's wanting completion when it comes to Something very traditional, wanting to come together with you, but he is in that mental battle, mental anguish. Because this is the Five of Swords. Look at him holding the Five of Swords. And this is a battle with ego. You know, wanting a, a, a commitment, wanting marriage with you. What is perseverance here? He's still wanting to persevere. Yeah, because look, Wheel of Fortune. This is all about learning lessons. You know, things going in you and his favor. So this masculine definitely is wanting to persevere, wanting to see completion with you divine femmes, wanting things to go in favor, wanting to learn lessons. Let's see what this dig in is about, Spear. What is this perseverance about? What is he wanting to see through completion about when it comes to divine femmes? Yes, because he is wanting to make wise choices. He is wanting to make better discernments. When it comes to you, Divine Femmes. There's some energy of him working on self. So he's being in an energy of persevering. Trying to work hard on self. Trying to complete healing cycles. And completions of ending a cycle. In order to have a fresh new start with you. That's beautiful. So let's push this to the side. What else is going on with the Divine Masculine Spirit? release he's in an energy of wanting to surrender wanting to loosen his hold wanting to relax wanting to be open to you divine femmes wanting to release fear anxiety and doubt and i don't know if he has quite done that yet due to trying to find the courage due to that five of swords mental anguish going back and forth What else is going on with the Divine Masculine Spirit? Yeah, he's definitely in an energy of, the, of that alone energy. 
feeling abandoned, lonely, lost, going within. Some of these masculines are in quarantine with a third party situation and it's really causing him to really retreat, go within, having to learn how to release things that no longer serve him, having for him to go within and figure things out and face himself. You know, it's not an easy thing to do. But I think it's sometimes this coronavirus and this quarantine is so good that for some people they may see it as a negative, but it's allowing you to really slow down. Some people are not working, so they're really having to just really work on self, um, figure things out around the house, work things out in the house, allowing you to slow down. I feel like um, we're so we're in an energy of just always moving, 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 and going, 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 that we don't really get to face our own inner demons, go within, and and really do some soul analysis and reflect. So this masculine definitely is an energy of having to go al to be alone and face himself and re release things that no longer serves him. What else is going on with the divine masculine? Ooh. Yeah, and this is an energy of having to transform. I feel like this masculine always wanted to be in control of things. His life was in stagnation, living in an illus illusion living in an illusion of life and it's allowing him to look release the need to control a situation to transform see and it's it's something that was he's in a, a beautiful space of isolation so if you're not hearing from your masculine due to the quarantine situation or whatnot this is allowing him to really transform and that's beautiful what else is going on with the masculine spirit? Regret. See, look, learning lessons. See, this time of him going by himself, going by what? Going within and being by himself and being in quarantine. It's allowing things for him to really um, learn lessons, figure it out. Think about the, the bad choices he's made. Thinking about the hurt that he's done to you, Divine Femmes. This masculine has a lot of regrets. And he's wanting to transform things and wanting to make things better between you and him. So stay strong, Divine Femmes. Find that um, inner peace and inner knowing. Continue to send this masculine love and light while he is doing some healing work. While he is doing some kind of transformation. is going on with the masculine angel spirits and guys what else is going on with divine masculine spirit oh so many cards abuse i feel like some of these masculines are currently dealing with a third party situation dealing with emotional and physical verbal abuse and this could be just something from his past too, inner child wounds, having to really retreat and go within and, and work on those triggers that he's, he is dealing with. I feel like some is due to him being quarantined with a, a marriage or in a relationship or a deep commitment. Maybe he's in a commitment currently and it's very abusive and it's something that is really having him to really go within and reflect on, causing him to really um, retreat open his eyes to see things have how it is and allowing him to evolve what else is going on with the divine mask on spirit he is researching something so this masculine could be researching you divine fams some of these masculines also could have been very verbally abusive to you or he had inner child wounds that he was dealing with from over the past relationships that he's having to heal too. But I feel like this masculine is researching, Googling you. For some of these masculines could be going, researching like um, healing work, could be researching just, um, what's the word I'm trying to say? Um, just, I don't know what it is, like mental health or some kind of just soul work that he could be researching, 
reading on. What else is going on with the Divine Masculine? Some of these masculines are maybe in an energy of trying to be celibate, trying to get out of a, a situation that they're stuck in. There's a lack of desire here that this masculine is feeling currently. And I feel like some, there's going to be some kind of communication coming in for you. But I feel like if he's in a third party situation, do know that there is a lack of desire, not really having sex with this person. He could be in a situation due to just codependency, due to um, a marriage, a relationship, due to family, due to scared to get out of a situation, due to just being comfortable. He could be researching how to, you know, maybe researching finding an apartment or getting out of a situation, researching a, a lawyer. What else is going on with the divine masculine? Yep. As I said that, because he is researching to leave a situation, a marriage or a, a relationship that he maybe he's he or she's been in for so long that he was stuck in. And now he's in an energy of really just having to do some research, working on self. Because why? There is ego here, feeling stuck, alone. And this is a, allowing this corn to really, to, for him to really do some soul searching and soul analysis. So yeah, guys, um, let's go ahead and give an advice for the people who are watching. The Divine Femmes, if you're watching, cross-watching, what advice do you have for the Divine Masculines? Surrender to passion. Get out of your head and feel the fire in your belly. Focus on the people or activities that ignite your passion and let it flow. Divine Femmes, remember, who your remember your power. No one is you and that is your superpower. So get out of your head. Stop comparing yourself to a, either a karmic or third-party situation. Ignite that fire within you. Find that fire again if you lost it. Remember who you are, okay? And let it flow because the masculine will see who you are and will be attracted to it. All right, guys, much love.